I started off my last week with a lost voice because I had just finished four days of Lollapalooza, so I was kind of stressed about getting my voice back. And then we had a lunch with free sandwiches to celebrate the end of our internship with all the full timers. I wish I could have participated a bit more, but my voice was so dead, so I just kind of sat there and ate my food. This is my breakfast that I eat in the office because I need to get there early because I'm scared someone will still messy. Okay, yeah, so, um. What did I come back? Lily Ann Sand has a long. <laughs> has a long love line. <laughs> Her work line is pretty um, good too, so she'll make a lot of money and she'll have a happy marriage. Let's go! And after work, some of the other interns and I head up to Chinatown and we're going to be reading all the food we got. This is a certain dumpling at a certain restaurant and it's a 6 out of 10. Okay. <laughs> So I got the chicken wings from Banchan and honestly they were kind of mid, I didn't really like them that much. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, get it, get it, get it. Are you kidding me? So today was my big day, it was the final presentation to all the interns. I presented my work to all the other data science interns and some executives at my company. I thought I did a bad job actually and got kind of upset, but then after I received some pretty good feedback from the executives, so it was all fine. Last week as an intern. Am I gonna get a bite of my sando in your vlog? You wanna be in it? <laughs> nice dude. Okay. Then after work, I went to the Design Museum in Chicago with one of the other interns, and they have some really cool exhibits about climate change. For example, this piece right here has a bunch of tapestries from different years, and each tapestry shows the daily high of temperatures in a year. And then I walked around the city around sunset time. We went to the river walk and took so many amazing photos. The sky was so pretty and the sunset was amazing. And after that, I headed to Navy Pier to watch the fireworks. So Thursday was our last in-person day, our last day in the office, and also the day that I started to feel very sick for some reason, but this is me making myself tea for the very last time. And after work, we had this team social kind of monthly meeting with free food, and then we made paper airplanes, and this is what my paper airplane looks like, but here is us testing all of our paper airplanes. And now I'm leaving my office for the very last time and handing in my badge. This is a very sentimental moment. Uh, just kidding. Honestly, I'm more sad that I can't get the benefits of like my corporate badge, but it's okay. Okay, we just finished our last day in person. How are you guys feeling? Good. I think y'all did great work this summer. It was yeah. really fun. In yeah, I'm really proud of Andrew. <laughs> uh, me too. Lindsay, you should be proud of yourself. No, I'm and so proud of Andrew. <laughs> yeah. I'm very proud of you. Oh, Lillian, I'm very proud of Lillian. Oh, I'm proud of everyone. If I had an internship, I would hire Lillian. <laughs> How do you feel about our last in-person day? Uh, bittersweet. Hopefully tomorrow is better than that. Yeah. On the last day of our internship, we had predetermined chunks of time where every crew would call us and let us know our offer decisions. So this is my reaction to getting the offer for return internship, which I'm super excited about. But unfortunately the grind does not stop because school is starting again soon and I'm on the e-board for one of my clubs, so I had to do a lot of work for that. So for our very last dinner together, I wanted to do superlatives for the intern group, so I got some paper plates and just wrote down some superlatives that obviously aren't targeted at all. We got All You Can Eat KBBQ and it was really good. And I'm also going to show you guys some of our superlatives that we handed out. Cancel. <laughs> 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 
Oh, no. Nah. 